Listening to our psychic power benefits our lives. Part 6 of 6 on Between Master and Disciples, given in English and Chinese, on February 4, 2018, in Kaohsiung, Taiwan, also known as Formosa. We pray for Ukraine, or you reign. Excuse him, wow. Sometimes it doesn't work and sometimes it all does. Just like my disciples. <laughs> yeah. Just like everybody who works with me. Ask them to do, they don't. And when I ask them again, oh, there are a lot, a lot of bananas, for example. <laughs> okay, good. I love you guys. You know, I can't do this if I need it. Ah, this is this kind of system is very funny. When I was a disciple, when I was so called disciple, you know, running around ashrams, I had no money. Whew. Everything tasted so good, but didn't have enough. <laughs> yeah. Even once a piece of chocolate didn't have money to buy. I gave all money away to masters. <laughs> and then and then I thought I could ask for it back sometimes if I wanted some ice cream. I told him, I said, if I want some ice cream, can I get some? They said, sure. I was too embarrassed. I was too embarrassed to ask, even though I already say that. I gave everything away. Oh, man. And now I have everything. I taste nothing. <laughs> yeah, I taste nothing. A lot of things that I want, I was like dying for it before. Now it tastes like nothing to me. Before I was dying for a piece of chocolate, and now chocolate is there just for the boys, the girls, or whoever that comes nearby, you know. It tastes nothing. I don't even feel like it. I don't feel like even opening it to taste to see if it's okay or not. I know it's not good. <laughs> I don't have the desire for it. This is a system of uh, torturing, you know. When you have no money, you want everything, <laughs> and you have not. When you have money, you have everything, you want nothing. Because you don't, <laughs> you don't care anymore, don't taste anything anymore. So don't feel bad if you are poor, okay? Don't feel bad. If you have enough to eat, to drink, and have a safe house, even a small house, is good enough, okay? In Hong Kong, I have only a small house. Because small mountains don't have a lot of big space. I and seven dog people stay together in a small place, as small as this. From that red thing there, that flower, up to the end here, that's it. And have bathroom, toilet inside, and a kitchenette. But later I cheated. I, I cook outside <laughs> on the veranda, you know. But lucky we have a veranda. I built it afterward so the dog people can run around outside when it's raining so they don't have to stay stuck in the, I don't know, four square meters with an old woman <laughs> who's always looking at something, <laughs> signing something, reading something. <laughs> if not, then checking video or something. Ah. See, it's no fun, you know? How come we like to run around outside, uh, breathing air and sniffing the grass, you just sitting there looking at papers. <laughs> yeah. And I was very happy. We were very happy. Yeah. They were very happy because I was always there. There's a small space and I can't run anywhere. I have a sofa I sleep on, but later the dog people also took care of it. <laughs> so, <laughs> so daytime I flip it over so they don't pee on my mattress, on the sofa mattress, you know. I put some blankets because they were still small, you know, babies, and they pee anywhere, anytime. They don't care about sofa, how expensive, or, <laughs> or, or bed or anything. Of course not. But the sofa is not expensive, though you can, you know, 
stretch it out, become a bed. Because uh, such a small room, where do you put a bed? Here, at least they give me a double, double bed. Wow, luxury. With two pillows. <laughs> but they know I have no chance to have any boyfriend or husband, so, so they put a long, long, you know, hugging pillow on one side. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, you call that the uh, effect? It's called a body pillow. Body pillow, yeah, 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 that's what it is. <laughs> they knew already that I don't need the whole bed. Why do they buy such a big bed? Huh? Just to humiliate me. <laughs> and then put a pillow there just to prove that they know everything. Yeah. If they know already I don't have a chance, so why will bother buying such a big bed, you know? But also my dog people occupy them. They love my bed. They have sofas, you know? I have at least four sofas for them alone. They also come to my little bedroom and have my sofa, my bedroom. It's their favorite hangout. <laughs> yeah, because I, I stick in the bedroom to work, you know. Recently, I don't go to the office because I was so sick. Not sick, but <coughs> when I go in the wind, I cough too much. So I stick in the bedroom. Also because I want to take care of the dog people. Because I observe that they use the dog people to make me worry more, so I just stay there with them. I, I take care of them instead. Instead of leaving them there and then coming back and forth and making more worries. You know, sometimes they forget, they don't bring water, sometimes they don't give them enough food, you know, etc. Or sometimes the dog people don't drink when I'm not there. And when I come home, everybody goes to the water bottle. <laughs> just like that. That's so funny. Yeah, after they pants around, when I first came in, everybody pants around with a wagging tail, and then they all jump on the water ball to drink together, like an orchestra, you know. <laughs> yeah, imagine. So I just stay with the dog people also, you know, so I work at home. <laughs> but they also don't, they love my bed. bed. Luckily, it's big, yeah. Because they jump around and they run too much, I worry, I worry they fall down. But the, the bed is big. Big enough for little dog people. They love my sofa also. I told you, dog people can teach you renunciation. If you think you cannot let go. <laughs> uh, nothing? Not listening? Oh, wow. Okay. If you think you are too attached or cannot let go, take a cup of dog people. Yeah? Then you have nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Your bank money is running out, quick, 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 yeah? For doctors, for food, for toys. Because they keep biting the toys, you have to renew them. Okay? And your clothes are always with the dog people. So whenever I go out, I have to brush them first. Otherwise, they smell, I think I'm a dog person also. <laughs> Hair all over, you know? Black, white, yellow. Mm. So whenever I go out to see you, I have to sneak out. Otherwise, they jump all over on me, one on the back, one on the shoulder, one on the front, one here and there, and uh, nip, nip, nip around. <laughs> okay, and then you have no bed, you have no sofa, you have just a little corner table, if you even have it. If it's high enough so they don't jump. And then you have a little the chair, with, they always like, want to check out what it is, that you don't let them come up. <laughs> they eat, they eat all my documents, my papers, and some photos of the initiates, which I need. <laughs> Luckily, I still have half, half, and I still can make out, is that a man or a woman? <laughs> yeah. And then I ask them, please print another one of this kind of men. <laughs> Not with the knowing, no, no, zigzag on it. Yeah. My God, I just went to the kitchen to cook some hot water for myself, came back, Oh my God, what? All over the floor, all photos of initiates. Oh my God, I'm so sorry. If I stay longer, we all gone. And I would not know who is who to even reprint it. You understand? I need them to organize a schedule, yeah? Yeah, he eat your face and her face. And... <laughs> Lucky there's a lot, so they just taste one each a little bit, each. If only one or two you finished, man, your application will never pass anywhere. <laughs> because 
we don't even know you exist. Yeah, your photo is gone, no evidence of the crime left. <laughs> oh my God, and then all my notebooks and everything, you know, sometimes my poetry books, and, oh, they enjoy them so much. I told you, you can become a monk or nun if you have dog people. You have nothing. Then you slowly learn that nothing is really that important except your love for them and except their love for you. Truly, it's very comfortable. I love you also, but I really love my dog people. <laughs> no matter what they do, at least you get a kiss and a hug and... Bad girl, mm, come here. <laughs> Don't do it again, huh? <laughs> okay, Zai Jian Na. Love you, thank you. <laughs> love you guys. I love you, love you. Love you. Don't worry, I will show up again. Don't worry. 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 I will show up again. Don't 要回复，要回复，才能够继续哈。OK 了啊 ，Thank you， 谢谢大家，乖乖，<笑>做好的人 ，Thank you 哈。你们做好人就是对师傅好的 ，OK。我用感激什么？嗯，我是要你们当好人，当圣人的啊，所以没问题了啊。OK， 再见啊。OK， 呀、yeah.。Russia, go home now. A vegan diet can help prevent plaque buildup in the blood vessels and lower the risk of heart disease. Make conscious food choices and stay away from processed foods, meat, dairy products, and sugar. Incorporate lots of leafy green vegetables and seasonal organic fruit in your diet. Malika Serawat, vegan. <laughs>